Welcome back. We are us, and this... This is me hoping that entering the Ivory Sanctum actually leads to something, because if I'm not mistaken... Mr. Angel McTrash should be imprisoned here. And while it's still up in the air whether I'm actually going to help him or not, let's see what happens, shall we? All right, and now we set off. So I have accidentally, accidentally, just, just a little. Yeah, we need to go here. I made Sela and Mr. Ed large. It was accidental that I made Sela large, which then meant I had to cast legendary proportions on Mr. Ed as well. And the only reason it actually happened is because I did not have the game paused, like I usually do when I cast these buffs, just to make sure that if I do why are these guys still here? Just to make sure that I don't accidentally cast something and then can't cancel it. Such as in that particular case. It's unfortunate that I had to waste two dra dinosaur bones on that, but what? Can you do? I actually hope that there's something going on here because if not, I'm going to be a little upset. Now, it's said they were holding what's his mug here, but for the life of me, I can't see where they could be holding him. Here, maybe? Yep, that's prop. No, that's the area exit. What? Maybe he's outside? And just to be clear, I did check the... the journal list for any quests... involving... What's his face? But there wasn't anything there. So I don't know. There's nothing here. Maybe here?
I don't know about you guys, but it looks like there isn't anything going on here. Which is weird, because didn't What's-Her-Face say something about him being here? I could have sworn. And there's no mention of him in this list. But I don't really care about him. I want the loot I would get from saving him. Or on the way to saving him, at least. Where was that other exit? There. Hopefully this takes us somewhere new. Well, I did what I could, so we're going to head over to Pelora's Fall, where... The last remnant of the Sarkorians are holed up. And I'm pretty sure this is where... What's-his-face is attacking? Um... Tosafin, that's the one. So, it's going to take a day for this, and then we've got, like, a demon army approaching some tower over there. Oh! By the way, I have finally encountered the bug where... If you get to chapter 5, which is where we are right now, you can no longer upgrade your forts. Which would be extremely useful for being able to teleport, like, here, so then I could just come all the way down here. Rather than having to spend five or more days traveling all the way from Dresden to here. Thanks, devs. Okay. Welcome back. It's been... It's been a little bit. Apparently a Galu warmonger is immune to confused. That's good to know early, I suppose. Oh, there is something else. Currently, my party is bugged with Holy Aura, which grants everyone extra spell resistance and such, so I don't even need to cast that anymore. Which means I also have to be careful about using this particular aura and or any other aura spell because basic I'm pretty sure they overwrite one another. And since this is permanent, and it's not coming from anyone. I've checked Ivu and I mean maybe it's coming from Sila, but I have my doubts. Not spell book. Nope, she is nothing that's giving her that effect. So yeah, it's just ex nihilo. Okay, so let's count, let's go ahead and use this on these two. And you. I need more dinosaur bones. Aren't they like 4,000 gold each? Regardless, I don't think... No, we do need it. And this for Regil at the very least. Anything else? Tell me, and I'll do it. Wise. Hmm. Oh yeah, I guess we could go ahead and do this. I don't know whether we'll end up going underground or swapping to some other area. So I don't want to summon too many of them.
I'm only using charisma. Hold on, doesn't she have a different helmet on now? Nothing to charisma, though. Yeah, I'm giving her extra charisma because it benefits the damage bonus you get with Smite Evil. Uh, anything else we can do early? I did realize much too late that Protective Luck only lasts one round, well, up to three rounds max. Now, anyway. So, casting it early is completely worthless, and trying to use it in the middle of a fight when she could just be doing damage makes it much less of a desirable uh, hex. That said, I don't, I don't have any alternatives, so whatever. Um, I guess we'll have her summon one, and then that's it. If there were anyone that could use Bless, it would be Lan. And herself. Rachel's just going to have to make do. Now I could give her more of these spells back, but it's not really worth it. Oh, she has a third one, I guess from the you're not supposed to be able to get another spell slot from spells that boost your stats like that. Um, this, I guess. More damage never hurts. And an extra slot here. That doesn't give me anything to actually do. Ooh, I can use this. Nice. Uh, whatever. Okay, I think we are all set. Wait, what else is on there? This she doesn't use, this she doesn't use. More of these, please. If I had meta ma no, if I had meta magic, the next level up doesn't actually do anything. Or have that many slots, so that'd be wasted effort. Nothing here. Oh, the waiting's never fun. The waiting keeps you from dying immediately. Oh, better. Why are you here, bud? Oh. They're also undead, which is really unfortunate for them. Oh, right, I forgot the energy thing. Uh, I forgot the energy resistance, that's what I mean. What the f- Now I can't even target the goddamn thing. If you double click while you have an attack selected, such as as is, as is indicated by my cursor, if you double click on the individual's portrait and they're an enemy, it should use it on them. Are you actually? I hate this game so much. I hate this game so much. So, so much. Into the fray. Can't even target Ivu. Okay. 
Death War. That's what we want. But she doesn't have this anymore, so yeah. Let's get out of here, finally. There's a sword over here. It's probably going to be... Funerary Dagger of Hid the Twin. The Funerary Dagger of a Sarkorian Chieftain. The hilt bear bears the following epitaph. I'm the mighty chief, Hid the Twin. My brother Hid and I rule the forest and the steep. And we are as inseparable in death as we were in life. Cool, you're still dead though. I could do this, or I could walk around and kill everything. But that sweet, sweet XP. We're not too far off from, well, it's like, I think we're s just shy of 200,000 XP from the final level. Now, if I had gone Legendary Path, or Path of the Legend, whatever, if I had gone with that path, well, this is Regil, I was looking at, I was looking at Lan's freaking portrait. If I had gone the Legend Path, Mara would be able to go up to level 40, but that's, one, that's retarded, you just can't get there, and two, you would have to bend the knee before Ioma Day. I don't like her. So, no. Right, he keeps dealing damage to himself because of the weapon. That, that's why I was confused. What? Oh, there it is. Hmm. What else is in this? This is a level 9 spell. Hmm. May as well. Where'd this... Right. It's a mind effect and they're all dead. That's my fault. So, let me fix it with a little bit of lightning. And we'll go with some of this. Because why not? Does anyone want to explain to me what just happened here? Ember just lost her turn trying to cast a spell that didn't go off. Thankfully, it didn't consume the actual spell slot, but I also lost her turn. So we're not even. Not even close. I can try this, but I know it's not going to work. Because the game is working as intended. Pretty good job so far, one might say. And we need his ability to pop the undead like six. Thank you. How much help? He's done. Is there anything else down here?
perception check fails. Maybe it's something back that way. Greater Skeletal Champion Berserker. That's not enough health to be a problem. Is it, Lan? Turn that off. And he whiffs the shot. Good job, Lan. Good job. I'm trying to see if there are any negative effects from being down here. I'd rather just let the guy come to me. Or let them wander in and see if they catch anything. That's new. It never did this before. Again, I'm just going to have everyone wait here and let the summons do whatever they want because it totally makes sense that you can't actually control them. Eh, wrong one. Wait. Oh, she is? Okay, that's odd. Wrong. Maybe not. Howdy there, people. And perfect. Kill them. That is a lot of demons over here. Also, that goddamn spell did nothing. Is immune to euphoric tranquility. What the actual frick? Oh. I did not see that it did. Wow. So it doesn't just do damage, it does extra stuff. It also has the potential to do extra stuff, which explains why the two times I've only been able to use it, it's completely worthless. Become friendly. Sent to another plane forever. have any other spells we can sacrifice to feed this thing again? Not particularly enamored with these. No idea why that actually consumes a turn and is it a free action? That's pretty stupid. Yeah, he'll be able to sw switch to that one. Low armor class, low armor class. What about you? Oh yeah, this is all fodder. My goodness, we have stepped in it, haven't we? They're all blind. Spell proved useful in that endeavor, didn't it? But it's all because they're like really low level. 
they weren't, this might have actually been problematic. Alright, so let's start cleaning up. This guy first. I wonder, will the Boogeyman finally be useful? Probably not, but let's find out. And I guess it's an elder might be okay. I don't think it really matters. God, there are a lot of undead over here. <laughs> it actually worked. These the prismatic spray, improved prismatic spray, actually turned one of the greater ravenous shadow ravenous greater shadows okay I guess that makes sense I was pondering whether that actually was a reasonable thing to title it but it, it makes sense it's a greater shadow that's also ravenous not a ravenous shadow that's greater it whatever there isn't I mean, the ground is already sort of messed up, right? So, we can mess it up just a little bit more, right? The game didn't like that. So, let's see. How do death spells affect the undead? Yep, a mutant. Okay. But what if I did this? Hmm. I really hate that how there's such a huge limit on its range, or how many times it'll bounce. But what can you do? Isn't it great to see monsters fighting each other? I don't know who was turned by the spell, but it's not like it really matters. I'm going to kill them all. Starting with this. I think I skipped his ability. I not only skipped his turn, I skipped Ivu's turn. Great. problem worked itself out. Any more undead on this side? No. So let's get in there. No glory Gotta love it. It 
It's in it's incorporeal, you goof. Hmm. I could probably put a cap on this if I move him here. And then do this. Nope. But soon. Soon. Um, we'll go with this one. Yeah, that's about how I like to see it go. Now we have his brother's dagger, I assume. Remnants of a ship that once bore a Sarkorian chieftain on their final journey. You know what I hate about what I what I also hate about the whole crusade thing? I have hundreds of thousands of coins and and I just can't convert if even if I were to convert all of the money I have right now, I, s I would not get an equivalent value out of it. Let's say I gave... I tried... Wait. Let's say I tried to convert... Oh... 700,000 coins. Or gold, whatever you want to call it. To... Um turn into resources for the crusade. I would not get 700,000 resources. Why is that? Why does that need to be a thing? What? Oh, you poor idiot. Bye now. So I'm guessing I'm going to be needing their funerary daggers for something later on. Probably should quick save even though it's... Oh, that's perfect. He's been feared. But he isn't... Look, look at these idiots trying to walk... Okay. Let's see. He's in range to do some good work. And I couldn't even get the opportunity. What's even going on here? Is this a gangbang? No, they're guarding this door. Don't, don't bother asking why I went with gangbang first, as the possibility of what was going on here. Just don't. Nothing I can do here but this. Can I just have my turn where things actually happen? Thank you. Um... Yeah. I think I could have cast another spell. That one was cast by Sorceress Reflex. Okay. Not going to waste spell slots on these guys. Not the ones that matter, anyway. Okay, hold on.
The shape of the tree resembles a tall... The shape of the stone resembles a tall, thin tree. And its surface feels like the texture of tree bark. Okay. Where is the thing that let me climb upwards? He asked before going in the complete opposite direction. Wait. So the way we came in should be over here. There it is. Checking the map. Shrine of Pelura, or do we climb? I think we climb. So let's quick save and then see where this goes. We did it! Yay! Land, if you please. Or could we just start the fight off anyway? <gasps> With Ivu, perhaps? Get another obstacle. Yes. I really wish they couldn't get... I really wish they weren't involved in fights because it's just a waste of time. I skipped his goddamn turn. The guide my blade. Still no reason for her to cast any spells. We will let Ivu do Ivu things, though. Got the whole flat footed thing. That's ah, fine. While I'm thinking about it, I really wish I could move her goddamn portrait. She's as much a character like everyone else. Why can't you? Anyway, I need to have him eat two more spells so he can cast that incredible, incredible spell. And we're done. Okay, so... I think we found everything that's to be seen up here. He tried to go this way, but there was nothing. So we're done here, I guess. Yeah. Wow. 
why though. Oh, whatever. Into the shrine. You, you, you really don't want this. I will admit, though, they caught us off guard. It's weird how you can still be caught off guard if you initiate the fight by attacking first. It doesn't make sense. If you literally strike first, you should have the upper hand. I don't, I don't understand how the rest of your party is considered caught off guard. Anyway, uh, this big bastard will be a problem. I think now we can go ahead and do this. Disappointing. Okay. Do we have anyone in the way? No. If we're careful. I'm not too worried about the... There, that's the one. Okay. Oh, what if I just burned you down? What? Galu. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, there's a guy inside of him, too. That's why. Alright, so now it's Ivu's turn, but first. Mr. Ed. And then... Curious. of a greeting. At least we don't have to fight that thing. Oh, thank you for coming to us. Hmm. Not exactly a fan of that one. That should definitely be giving more health than it does. Everyone says 19, but it 
has to be more than that. Eh, I don't want to waste diamond dust casting true seeing, so... See, let you join in, too. And I like how I just walk into the enemy and trigger a fight and everyone's just ready and raring to go. Well, let's go ahead and do this. Now, if they fail their saving throw, they'll be forced to target Mr. Egg. And no one has to get hurt. Could force them to target the Treant instead. Mm. So we'll do that, and then have Ivu. She should still have the buff from the last fight. Get in here, too. Not a fan of that. Hmm. Now, if he's going to hit only once, it may as well count. Glad he attacked that thing instead. Hmm. Actually, I want you gone. on another one. You're lucky. Hold on. And another for good measure. Regil's deal. Mm. I don't get why he doesn't have heals a lot more than it looks like it does.
looked like a bird, but died on his feet like a man. Good for him. Ooh, there's a side path. Ooh. We like side paths. One day we'll get to the bottom of this. Oh, we could do this. And then... Yeah, an inscription in Hallet that reads, O Sarkoris, our tears are for you, our lost land. Okay. There's nothing else going on in this little alcove, though. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is where we're going to end the video for today. Uh, aside from dealing with the crusade crap, I enjoyed myself for the most part. I'm still a little miffed about the bugs that keep screwing me out of my turns or actions during my turns, but what can I do? I'm already 300 and probably 40 hours by now into the game, so nothing that can be done about it. Nevertheless, I hope you guys enjoyed yourselves and everything you've seen here. We'll be back with another episode on Tuesday, so stay moist. And so, with all that said... We will see you. Next time.